Good afternoon, I'm Faye Barker. NHS England's medical director has warned people not to squander the gains made against coronavirus on the eve of a major easing of restrictions in England. From tomorrow, the stay-at-home rule ends and people can mix in groups of six outdoors and some sports can restart. Helen Keenan reports. This afternoon, the government is expected to confirm that more than 30 million people have had a first vaccination. Our play is here, so it is going well, but still challenges ahead. Yeah, Dasha from Health and Charities today to start sharing vaccines target, they say. Hannah, thank you. Now, there's been some progress made to dislodge a giant container ship stuck in Egypt's Suez Canal. The... There's been an international outcry after more than 100 unarmed civilians, including children, were killed in Myanmar yesterday. The shootings by the country's security forces came as people once again took to the streets to protest against the military takeover. It's the worst violence Myanmar's seen since the start of the coup in February. Paul Davis reports. Finally, to cricket, where the third and the deciding one-day international between England and India is underway. That's it. Lucrezia Millerini will have an update at quarter to four. Until then, bye-bye.